We're in for a banger of a series today. We're happy to be back in the studio. We have the players here. We can guarantee a lot of excitement here on the desk and in the studio. And we've already heard Broken Blade saying he has some pocket picks. He has something spicy for Schalke here in this draft. We'll have to see if they can bring out a god card like they did versus XL. Even if you're in game, take a deep breath. Very important. It's a game changer. We shouldn't be demoralized if we drop a game or two games, and we shouldn't be overexcited if we win a game. It's just both of these things can and probably will will happen. Um, test, 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 test. Hello, hello, test, test. We're gonna play on stage again. Again. Guys, really don't into the pack into the packages, especially if it's a banger game and it turns into ton tons of fighting everywhere. Sometimes Corky comes back from base, revives with a package or TP, and it comes and cleans it up. So just watch for this situation, okay? Yep. Good luck, guys. Yep. I'll be getting prior. You can go like... top as well. Yeah. Okay. I'm coming. Oh, yeah. Coming, coming, coming. Looking for the stun here. Mickey has nowhere to go. No flash available. And Schalke in the bottom lane are finding advantages. Right. He trolled. He trolled. He trolled. He trolled. Broken Blade now on the front line trying to get away from Reckless Mickey and Wonder. Wonder gnaws him into the wall and Broken Blade is going nowhere today. Jankos chasing off the rest of Schalke all on his lonesome. They're looking for every kill they can get. Another one goes into the back pocket. Wallop lands on Abadage. Gilly is forced away as Reckless takes the kill. Abadage gets one, but that's an ace and G2 have won this game. DP behind him, yeah? Oh, yeah, 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 They'll try to go on me. Broken Blade. Blade. Reckless is in base. Blank. Reckless is in base. He can't join the fray, but only two players from Schalke are here, and Broken Blade already under half HP. There's the kind of instant game from Neon. The sleep's going to land only onto Mickey. Yanko stunned up. The shockwave hits one. G2 Yarrow. able to back away. The arrow still connects on two. Limit as here comes another apprehend. Oh, the what? Sleep, the gargoyles, the shield's not enough. Shut down. Nice. Nice. Oh. Limit is down. Wonder able to help kill Broken Blade and Reckless has joined the fray, but a little bit too late. He's shut down. Abadage and Neon can push forward. It's 2v2. Mid laner and AD carry versus mid laner and jungler. Abadage goes in this alone. Is. Neon's going to join the fight. Abadage flashes away and near Cathian reigns. <laughs> Wonder coming in and the pain train is not stopping at the Schalke station. G2 able to pick up another couple in this top lane fight and all that came. And after all the kills are secured, G2 secure the Nexus. They're pushing and we like kind of group too much sometimes. It's, it's my feeling. And we have to uh, like be, be more patient. Like when I have a full Jungle, full camps up. And I could see a snowball in this because you were really ahead in jungle, you were really ahead in mid, you were 2 0. That was pretty strong. Like, yeah, we were really strong, you know. We could have snowballed this and taken over the game. At some point, like, I yeah. just moved and then I caps just kept promo pushed and I just yeah, lost so many uh, waves. Like but trying to get something and then we fuck up the fight because we fuck up something maybe. Maybe. We'll probably pick support, jungle, and mid first. Right? Uh, we we didn't need first 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 first. First. No matter what happens, I'm proud of you guys. I think we're doing a good job tracking that heat piece. Let's, let's keep yeah. doing it. He's six. Can we one shot? He doesn't have much. If I pull him. Gideas ghosting in. Wonder knockback. Does still have the flash. He's going to use it early. Gideas still underneath the tower here. We'll be able to get the kill. Could win the fight, but Broken Blade found the engage. Oh, he finds Caps with the upper hand. Caps flashes away, but there's no escape from the Broken Blade. He brings down the hammer and Caps is dead. Decimating Smash going to go wide as well. The explosive cast hits onto Wonder. He pops his ult to try and get away. Mickey does have the flash, but doesn't really have anywhere to go. Shell could get two. Caps gets onto the back line as Neon is forced away. Limit trying to get away as well, but Reckless is on the hunt and on the chase and the shutdown comes out. Neon down, Jinx down, but here oh, comes Broken Blade. the Noxian guillotine. Broken Blade. Cutting through G2 as quickly as he can as Caps. Now it's all on him to do it again. Broken it's Blade! Table. Broken with the decimate, heals himself back up. Caps with the shot, stays in a pen to get it's a quadra! And Broken Blade bring down the axe! Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Get him! Tip it up, tip it up, tip it up. Guys, <laughs> end, 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 end. Let's fucking reverse sweep G2, huh? Well, Schalke here need this win. They're going to force us to a game five, and you see how much it means to them. Here for a fight here, though. Flash. Broken Blade! Yeah. Broken Blade flashes in. Limit goes onto the back line as well with the Magnus Storm on the back. It's going to do a lot of work to shut down. Broken Blade opens up with the Noxie Guillotine. Wonder the next target. Ooh. It's all on Caps. It's all on Reckless Neon. Still alive. Still has that GA. The guard, Gargoyle Stone Plate will keep Wonder alive. Two for one in favor of Schalke. Null fear so far. Look at Limit. Look at Limit. Just to clear out Limit. He's on Caps. In. He gets pushed back. The Shockwave still connects. And Caps is. Gone! Magnuson coming out! Let me see! Watch Neon! 
Neon watch Neon able to survive. Reckless has to flash away. Neon going forward, tumbling in, looking for the kills here onto G2. And Shao Kahn have done it. They found two kills and they have found the silver scrapes. But for them, it is a golden moment as they shot down G2. And then they're going to game five, boys. Just enter. Oh, by the way, often in games five in G2's history, they play full lane swap and try and dive people level three. I wouldn't be surprised to see this shit. So just cover it and TP on them and just fuck them and double kill them or something, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. uh, they've done this quite a few times. Lane swap? No, 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 no. Like, like lane stomp. What a series we've had. Seriously, oh I was expecting to be back home eating pizza by now. Yeah. yeah, and after the second game, I thought it was over. Yeah, but the reverse sweep is alive. I think Volibear can force a lot of stuff level three, level four, and Lucian is probably going to be winning the lane. So I think it's really important that we just survive this mid jungle early, and then I think we'll probably win later in the game. Oh, they engage the double flash, double knock up. The stun lands Oof. and first blood to Reckless, but here comes the TP. Broken Blade gonna join the tray. Infernal Chain splashed away there by Reckless. Does have the stage presence, looking for that W. Doesn't oh. quite have the heal in time for Yankos. Meanwhile, in the mid lane, there's another trade as Caps tries to fight off Abadagi. There's the TP immediately from Broken Blade Limit going in with a Magnus Storm, and they're looking for the damage. You can see everyone the rocket. In. Here comes Aatrox G2. You've been in this spot before. And the Aatrox lands, and the Emperor finds his victims. A double for Neon, a double for Broken Blade, and wonder. Oh my god, it's almost just upper, man. Freaker, dagger. Spice, Just take the drink. Careful, Lucian, though. Ragas has flashed this fight. I think they're really fine there. Like, they have no. I'll just fucking start a fight. Keep your eyes on Caps. You gotta keep your eyes on the Lucian. He's stepping forward. Broken Blade with a two level advantage. Caps only level 13. Dragon down to 3,000. Scuttle Crab now secured for Schalke. Gilius on that front line. Wonder with no ultimate. Broken Blade going in with the final chase. There's Mickey. There's the culling. There's the encore. They catch Gilius. The limit dies onto the back line. And Caps is immediately exhausted. Limit just about Neon's getting reset. Come the rest of Schalke. Neon getting excited, as I'm sure all the Royal Blue fans out there are as well. And I think the G2's at a point. I thought they were gonna struggle. The longer this game went on, but it turns out they now have an unkillable cop. It's like four bodyguards and protect the president. One last sally into the breach as Neon oh, gets man. culled to half his HP. Wonder tanks the tower for a year. The charm comes out and is all on limit. He's already dead before he can even join the fray. No flash burn, no madness <laughs> storm. Shut down. I'm sorry, but did you have some DPS, Shalka? Because it looks like you're the ones getting DPS down. <laughs> Like that though. I'm so fucking close to the one series. I think we learned a lot of stuff for the future. I think there were we had like a lot of bad moments but we had like really really good moments as well. Yeah, I learned a lot. The same yeah. as well. And uh, we clashed up real well. I think uh, there's a lot to take away from. It's a, this vision game was so fucking fun. It's all serious. They were they were so good. And then we became bad with the vision game throughout the series. And then we were like holding them, you know, neck to neck. Firstly we can yeah, we played good, we can be proud, no? Just be happy with it and just don't dwell and be able to move forward, no? We're still in playoffs, right? The show must go on. Actually, for balling, these guys really like, especially people, really, really like TPing. He likes being very active. He likes rolling a lot, he likes TPing a lot, but he likes influencing the map more than he likes playing for himself or dragging resources to him. So we need to be aware of this and not like take stupid fights where he can TP behind and just like clean up the fight, okay? People skip camps, go bot. Fourth, kill the enters. Fifth, please if we're ahead, play together, guys. All right, here we are. Welcome to the Cash Desk for Shao Kahn No Fear versus Fnatic. We are so torn on the desk. We're actually gonna ask Twitch chat to help us at the start of our cast decide who is actually the favorite. Yeah. We're going back in the I can also look to fight here. Yeah, Udiel, can you look? No flash? Yeah, we can. Olaf, you're Olaf here, I'm here as well. We can kill Olaf. Yeah. Uh, they're also here, I'm hovering actually, I'm hovering. I'm hovering, I'm hovering. Go on TF, go on TF. Doing behind enemy lines, he steals the Olaf. Oh, he goes back Abadage. over the wall. Abadage is just too damn clean. Self, they got nothing on him. Yes. Oh, GG, GG. Nice! That's GG, no? Hillisang trying to find it, he's managed to lock up two self just running in, he's using the ultimate upset on the backline, untouched for now, Gilius on a rampage, but still, the Olaf is alive, and finally self is turn it back, limit taken down, upset still standing, Abadage, Broken Blade, Gilius, the top side of Shalko, what can they do, leap in from Abadage, will not find the abduct. 
I can look. This guy no flash, no flash, no flash. He has no E2. I can go more, maybe. Sang now on the retreat, trying to dash away. Niski trying to find the sun card, but no. Shalka leaping forward. Neon leaping forward. They're pushing in. Neon going over the side. He's going to one shot. Pippo immediately isolated on the Akathian rain. And Shalka are wiping the floor with Fnatic. Oh! oh. Neon. Nice, nice. nice Baba. Nice, nice. Coming top. They want to go into me right now. Oh, they're, they're going top. for BB. They're going for BB. Yeah. Help him top. Help him top. They go me bot. I think. Oh, let's they're go. They're going me bot. They're going me bot. I kill him. Okay. I think I, can't, I don't know if Kai says there. I don't think Kai says there yet. Just nice, round to our tower. Nice, I think. Nice. Here comes Gilius. We both can try to deny this one. The knockup can come through, but Gilius with the sidestep there. Whippo's already gone. Gilius in the pit all on his lonesome. Three K on the dragon. Killisang desperately trying to turn it upside on the outside, but nothing is happening. Selfie wants to get anything done, but the CC is there. Shalka are slaughtering Fnatic. Our carries are fed. Fnatic are lost across the map. Upset can't even get back to his own base. This is domination from start to finish for Schalke as they move up to match point. <laughs> we need one relief like at one time. Yeah. That's why I wanted level 3 gank because I think, it's Lee who's not gonna uh, like... I think, I think no gank, but he should not go crab. You should not go crab, you should go mid and find yeah. them, push out together and yeah. run into bot. It's oh, like when I'm fast and I get Rift Herald, the games look so easy, you know? Yeah, of I mean, course, we broke mid tower twice and the game is just quick. We are going to see an, an adaptation in terms of side selection. This time it looks like Fnatic will be on blue, Shalka okay. will be on red. So there will be adjustments, Kadrill. No matter what in draft, there will be adjustments. And my question is, how much of the strategy changes? It's Azir, it's Azir, Azir. Okay, he's keeping as well with the Aatrox. Azir? I hold Aatrox, yeah. I hold Aatrox. Taken down in the end. Niski got, managed to take down Neon. Whippo on the backside. Big healing. Can he finish the job? Abadage needs to get out. Limit will get taken down. Oh, 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 oh. Will they go for the dive? Of course they will. It's Fnatic. They're looking to finish it. Abadage flash out to safety. Abadage looking to turn. Oh my god. Back on the Whippo. Valk back on the Whippo. Abadage, 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 are you kidding me? No! Nice. Let's go. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Oh my god. Nice, 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 nice. <laughs> Whippo now going in. Whippo wants to get it kicked off. Infernal Chains is going to go in. Broken Blade pulled back. That's Hillisang with the follow-up. Three-man, but it's Abadage off to the side. Eyes on the Corky. Shao could do so much damage. It's a meat grinder. The Urgot is still alive. Whippo does good damage, but it's just not enough. They are dissecting Fnatic in this fight. Time is ticking for Fnatic, but is it out here? Body slam forward from Limit. He drops. It's Hillisang and upset versus the world, but the bot lane will not be enough, and Shalka Nolfear will sweep aside Fnatic. Uh, yeah, man. Good job, guys. Let's go! Good job. Not out in an instant to shop a new one to make pro this Sunday. And it was a miracle. Good shit, guys. Nice, nice, nice. Shout out, guys. Come on. Go, bro. Actually, hold it. Okay, okay. In, 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 in. On three, okay? Down, 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 down. down. Okay, One, two, three. Shut up! I think I feel like it was pretty fast, three zero. Um, obviously, we're just happy, you know, to be a team like this. Obviously, like they're a really strong opponent, and yeah, we're just looking forward for the Sunday match. I guess we just need to prepare for the for Rogue tomorrow. See what they play. Study them. Like we're here to play to win, right? Testament fight them. If we're going to contest, we just need to think about the off side of the map if they can get there. If they're invading our, our bot side buff, just be aware of TPs, if they're good or not, and you be aware that TP shit is on the table. If we're con if they're contesting our top side buffs, then we should be aware of, of if supports can roam, and if we can roam with our support, and they can't because we're running bot, for example, and then they they can just turn the whole game. No, if we if we get numbers numbers advantage on it. So I just want to think, do we, tr do we trade or do we contest? And if we contest, what is the status of the roamers? I think we focus on the swap and second buff. Early game should be pretty Gucci. And obviously, same stuff as usual. If we're winning, just play together, sync our bases. If we're losing, just make them flip it and mash. I'm Medic. I'm joined by Vedius for this final elimination series of the weekend. Schalke versus Rogue. And I don't think many of us expected to be here just a couple of weeks ago. It's very true. What surprises me is how many of the analysts have actually put their faith in Schalke. No. Like, uh, the analysts quite rightly say Schalke is riding the momentum right now. I think, for, I think we can yeah, yeah, you need get to go. Stay on the tower. Uh, Looking for Odo one there here underneath the tower. Odo just hits level 10. Gilius going in there with the stun and broken blade with the flawless duet. We'll get the lockup. Gilius tanks it for as long as possible, but look at the healing on Odo Omni. In the end, he'll go down. Gilius able to walk out of the back of tower range. Okay, They're I'm ready. Us. They're sleeping us. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I'm okay. ready to go. Ready to go. 
Okay, okay, just, just take the Drake now. Drake is ours, Drake is ours. Yeah, we get the Drake. The floor is Chuet, doesn't get the stun. Gilius the reset on the Drake. Inspire goes in, Gilius secures it. Limit tries to jump onto Inspire, but Ooh. immediately the stopwatch is there. Abadage dived in here as Larson tries to put the damage down. Limit already down to half HP. And here comes Trimby. And here come the rest of Rogue. Gilius, you can have every Drake Depends you damn well like. The quadra kill for Larson. Clinical execution, clean game from start to finish. Rogue looking dominant in game one. Actually, so sad. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I walk backstage and we just know you can't even win. Yeah, it's just and that's so fail. fucking depressing. Join the fight to things. Lickety split as Larson doesn't have flashback up. The gravity field's gonna come out. The fear does land. Abadage flashing forward, looking for the damage. They don't quite have enough. Abadage taking it up for ages. And he will fall. One for one trade. Abe. I'm ready, I'm ready. Nice, he's here, he's here. Shoot in the flesh. Kill Nar, kill Nar. I snap too, snap too. Kill Nar, no, no, no. Nice. Okay. Limit has a great position here. Gilius dived on TP's coming in. There's the Magnet Storm as well. The damage is just so big onto Inspired. Oda Wamne tries to join the fight. Broken Blade going in with the Paranoia. Hans Summer forced away. The fate's cool. We'll bring back Tim Reed. Limit almost dead. But Oda Wamne dives across the wall. And now it's on Neon and Abadage to try and put the damage down. But the Chaos Storm's going to do a lot. Neon dives in and kills off Hans Summer. We thought it would be Abadage who'd get it. But Neon gets the double. We should win now, though. Guys, it's so third, yeah. Rogue, they're at their last defense. Only one tower stands as Schalke look to equalize the score. Schalke can just walk it in. The Magnet Storm finds all four. And Neon laps up the kills. Abadaga gets one, Broken Blade gets another. And Schalke take the second game in the series. The game is so easy, by the way. Like, if you're playing scrims right now, we would end in 20 minutes, they would FF, you know? Like, but we're making it ours, like harder for ourselves. So just calm down, like we really just need to take a fucking right. breather. The comp was good and we played the fights really well. We found some good engages. Uh, uh, the, my feeling from these two games is they are playing very Thanks. scripted and they always do the same stuff. Yeah. yeah. They play into bot, they swap by Herald or they yeah. play yeah. into Herald. Doesn't matter. And I, I think I as long as we stay calm and pick our correct fights, <laughs> We're gonna yeah. beat them like yeah. they are not I mean, doing think... anything special. The series resets now. We're one and one. Best you of three. Know? Best of three. Uh, obviously, a lot of learnings to be taken for both teams moving into the series. But in any case, what we can say for sure is that Schalke have come prepared with more draft options. And Hans Summer is here, the explosive cast will knock them back. Gilius doesn't have the flash limit, diving in with the Magnus Storm. They're trying to catch out Hans Summer. Trimby's still alive. Hans Summer's still alive, exhausted, survives somehow, dodging away from the Chaos Storm. In the end, Hans Summer will go down. But how much has been sacrificed here by Schalke? Larson flashes away from Broken Blade. Odo picks up a double kill. Inspired, not with his team this time, instead secures the Cloud Drake. I'm tipping, I'm tipping. Go slow, okay, okay, go slow. Okay, okay. Wait for my TP. They is don't he? see me, they don't see me. Here comes the flank, inspired, not with the rest of Rogue. And here is Broken Blade. Already Gilius, already dead. Larson pops the stopwatch. Gilius goes down. Broken Blade pops the stopwatch of his own, but Neon has fallen. And although you're gonna get Larson, you're gonna get wiped off the map. Broken Blade, not too much he can do. A double for Odo in the front line once again. Rogue were just too strong in the final fight. They executed well, and they will bring themselves to match point. Yeah, that's not first, look, huh? look, look on my watch, let's go. We're here to cover. Realm Warp comes through. They're looking for Trimby and Han Summer. Han Summer, no flash. The double stun isn't enough. Inspired does not have flash. And it's knocked straight back in. Ooh. But here's the Magnus Storm. Inspired going in with the best lap. And there gets the kill onto Trimby. Larson now TPing in. And Abadage, even with the spell flux, can't do much. That might be the season, no? I, I have ulti right now. Oh, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, Shalke have decided they need to pull the trigger somewhere. Odo Wamne does have flash to try and get out of this. Slicing Mouse from going in. There's the stopwatch. And here come the rest of Rogue. Odo Wamne got a flash across the wall. Trimby there. Onslaught of Shadows in by Gilius. The shutdown goes down. Hans Summer not able to join the fight as of yet. And Trimby's the next one on the target. Has to jump away. But Gilius diving forward, diving backward. Fate's cool. We'll keep Trimby alive for just a moment. Shalke on the offensive. Those mantras ease, those speed up could be huge. Shalke may have turned this fight right here. They find Odo. They find two more and Gilius is not done yet stunned up by Inspired the Realm Warp's gonna chase them in but that bear should be able to escape for the moment Dragon on the cards though for Schalke and this is number three and for even stable in the game but we just kind of throw 
Maybe they feel like they can win now. They have more oh. kills than enemy now. So one in this push. What a shout to see. There's no oh, one. here we go. No, no, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's in the perfect position for the flank here. Inferno Drake starting. There's the culling. Here goes Oh no! Oh, he gets stopped immediately. Limit with a perfect play. But the rest of Rogue are able to dive in. Inspired gets on Neon. The shutdown on Abadage. Limit did everything in his power to stop Odo getting into the fight. But he forgot about the rest of Rogue. TP's coming in. Rogue are looking to book their place in finals weekend. That was a crazy engage, huh? What the fuck? <laughs> That's five man round? The they, they didn't wumble combo it. Dude, he was screaming. Like Dude, that was a scream yeah. right there. Dude, yeah. I'd scream too if I got that one. It's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Pretty close series. But I think they played a bit better, no? Yeah. They just like, I think, made training mistakes. <sighs> it's close, though. Still happy that well, we did this, but at a point we lost seven games in a row, we were like eighth place or something, we were really struggling. We made top four, and we almost made top three, I think. Yeah. We almost made top three twice, versus G2 and versus Rogue. I think both sets we could have won if we played a bit better. 